so I was at work today. I don't normally work on Mondays. And so I didn't pack my meds. So I have a client at work right now with color on her hair. And I just ran home to get my medications ready. So that is what I'm doing right now. Oh, my head is killing me so bad today. And my stomach is hurting and I think it's because I'm hungry. I'm hoping that I only have about two more days of this. Mm. Fudge. Ow. Ow. I just stuck my finger. Ugh. I think I'm going to cry. <laughs> okay. I'm all right. <laughs> I just am a little bit overwhelmed. <laughs> I'm like not even, it's not even that big of a deal. It's just like I have to give these shots to myself tonight and I just stuck my finger with a needle, which was not fun. And I need to get back to work because I have a client with color on her hair. <laughs> so I'm a little bit frazzled right now. And my head is killing me. All right. All right. Well, I don't know if I'm going to film myself doing these shots tonight because I just need to get them over with, but I'll give it a try. I really don't want to do this. <laughs> so bad right now I'm being like the biggest baby right now <laughs> oh geez I'm just like having the biggest pity party ever for myself <laughs> it just sucks like I don't know nobody wants to stick themselves with needles and I just want to lay in my bed <laughs> I have such a headache Ugh. <laughs> All right. I just need to get this one over. Oh, fuck. oh it burns. I did it. So it's December 6th, and we are headed to the doctor. We have to be at our appointment in about 15 minutes and we're still in Indiana, yikes. watching that's gonna be like oh my god you guys are gonna be octo parents no we're not doesn't matter how many they take out it matters how many they put back in <laughs> I feel like everybody who says we're gonna have triplets should give me a hundred dollars to help start paying for those triplets <laughs> <laughs> because it's not that I don't want three children it's that I don't want to have to pay for three children at one time, at one time. you better stop saying that you're gonna jinx us 
I just want one. Even if they only put one, I just one, want one embryo in, it can still Just one beautiful, split. healthy baby that I can take care of for like a year or two, be comfortable, learn how to be a good dad, and then we can do it again and we'll have two kids. And then? And then we'll get used to having two kids and we'll take care of them and we'll learn how to take care of both at the same time. And then we'll have a third job. And then we can be done. Have them spaced out a couple years apart. We'll be able to learn how to be parents and be good parents and take care of multiple children at once instead of just being like, here you go, Ryan. Let's go from zero to 500 million. So exciting day for me because I don't have to do my stimulation meds anymore. Then I have to go back tomorrow for blood work and then I'll go back Thursday for egg retrieval. So keep us in your prayers everyone. Our doctor printed off a picture for us to show. These are both my ovaries and my eggs or my follicles I guess that are in my Breeze. There's a baby in there somewhere. Yeah. Why don't you like to create your lap with it? Anyway, so one of our our baby is in one of these follicles. <laughs> Just chilling. Do you want to know how many future grandchildren you have now? <laughs> yes, I do. And yeah, at six o'clock in the morning, I sure the heck do. Tell me. Do you want to guess? One of them. Twenty-three. You're, you're about 15 short. 38. Oh my God. What? <laughs> 38. Oh my 